Akal Prahara and I'd like to welcome you in my room here at Micro Hotel Davao City. Yay! Yeah, of course, traveler. <laughs> okay, so um, my seminar is still tomorrow, so I still have a little time. And I thought of this topic for now. Marami pa rin gustong siguro lumipat ng bagong trabaho o kaya ay nag-a-apply ng trabaho o kaya ay marami pa rin naghahanap ng other opportunities. Kaso lang, during a job interview, I noticed this. Ang daming nagsasabi when asked of, to describe themselves, they are the first ones to kill their chance of being employed. Bakit? Palaging sinasabi, I am moody. Alright? So stop it. Don't ever say you are moody. Even if once in a while you are moody or you're not in the best of moods and you get to a job or you get to be a problematic, sometimes it's normal. But you don't have to say it in the job interview. Because how can you sell yourself? Besides, if you say you are moody, nobody likes to hire you. Why? Nobody likes to work with somebody grumpy, ayaw nang nakasimangot, yung palaging uh, problematic, o kaya palaging galit, o kaya masungit, yung mga ganon, wala talaga. You really lose your chance when you say that. So, stop killing your chance of being employed. Huwag mo nang sabihin yun. More of, more of uh, something positive about yourself. Even if they say weakness, you can say a lot of weaknesses, but not I am moody. Kasi talagang nakaka-turn off yon sa mga job interviewers. They really don't like to work with somebody moody and that reflects that mahirap kang kausap, mahirap kang bigyan ng mga challenges, mahirap kang, uh, let's say, pakiusapan if there are changes in the organization or maybe changes in the schedule or maybe yung madadagdagan yung workload mo, yung things like that. They would really think twice about getting you. Yan. So take note of that kasi maraming nagsasabing, I am moody, just stop saying I am moody. There is something better about you. I'm very, very sure at yun yung yun yung ipakita mo na you are very flexible approachable you can handle challenges you can whatever now if you say you really are honestly moody then check mo naman sarili mo ano ba talaga yung problema kasi sayang naman di ba uh, people should like be grateful more about life than just be moody or just make a big fuss about small things yun kahit na sabihin na natin big thing come on you really need a job, you really need money to support yourself or your family, you really need this kind of job, so dapat you try your very best to give a very good impression. But, if honestly you really are so moody, then check, 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 check yourself. There are things na siguro kinikimiki mo pa na nanonon pa, na hindi na dapat, uh, hindi na dapat maalala, o kaya hindi na dapat banggitin, o kaya hindi na dapat, you know, you, you just let go. Just let go of whatever happened in the past because today is another day and the future is really something to be designed by you. It takes a lot and it all depends on you. So if you need a job, stop saying I'm moody. Alright? <laughs> okay, take note of that and that is something that I can share with you. This is Gina Akal Prohorov and don't forget to subscribe. Just subscribe. So that if you, so that you get to know my latest video, alright? So bring my love with you and it will carry you through. Bye-bye!